It is on this Sabbath day in this empty church that I pray to thee. What am I to do not to lose faith in the people of this town? Please, God, give me the strength to lead these sinners to righteousness. Last night, the demons of my past visited me in a nightmare. What are you trying to tell me, Lord? That the citizens of hope are descending into darkness, just as I was once, trapped in the shadows of Satan's embrace? I personally invited every last soul in town to today's service. I will bring them your word, Lord. I will show them the way. It is indeed disappointing that your fellow citizens prefer the pleasures of the flesh to the spiritual salvation offered by this sanctuary. In vain has the voice from heaven said of the whore of Babylon, Come forth, my people, out of here, that ye have no fellowship with her sins, and that ye receive not her plagues. And what exactly would they be receiving here, Padre? Insults? Rebukes? Life's too damn short to spend it listening to self-righteous sons of bitches like you. Free round of drinks for anyone who wants to follow me back to my saloon. Clyde Forrester, is that what you came here for? How dare you turn my flock away from the light? If it wasn't for sinners like me, you'd be out of a job, Padre. You can't save him if I don't tempt him. Enough, you snake! Get out of my sight! I know all about you, father, so don't go getting all high and mighty with me. You're no better Get than a- Get out of this sanctuary! Lo, I come quickly, saith the Lord, and my reward is with me, to render each as his work shall be. Reverend! Reverend Ray, I heard gunshots at your brother's farm! What? That bastard child will burn in hell! I saw Billy in town. Saw him going into the saloon. Oh, these hyenas have no respect for anything. They're no better than dogs. What are you doing? Have you no shame? Reverend Rye, I came when I heard the gunshots. We need to get the sheriff. And you? How dare you steal from the dead? What the hell do they need it for? Besides, half the town is gonna be all over this place in two Get seconds. out of here! Out! Or I swear all to right. God! Fine, I'm going. But this ain't over. Out! Get out of here! For what? You gonna send me to hell? Clyde says you're hardly a man of God. He says- Enough! For twenty years, I followed the light and denounced the darkness. Day in, 
and day out I labored to save lost souls. All for you, Lord. So why, why have you forsaken me? How could you let this happen? Help me, Lord, please. Tell me, what do you want from me? That bastard child's been a burden on this earth since the day he was born. Shiftless, no count coward. How dare he end a life as righteous as my brother's? If I could, I would kill him. Lord, is that what you want from me? To be your sword? I've spent 20 years preaching to hyenas and wolves, but maybe there are some who are beyond redemption. Is that what you're telling me, Lord? To destroy those who cannot be saved? Is that what you want? Then that is how I will serve you. And I will execute great vengeance upon them with furious rebukes. And they shall know that I am Jehovah when I lay my punishment upon them. It's time to dust off some old compadres. Can't go out there like a clay pigeon. Whew, haven't laid eyes on these equalizers in 20 years. How many lives did they take? No matter. This time they won't be tools of Satan. This time we'll be guided by the light of the Lord. With what measure ye meet, it shall be measured unto you. What are you up to, Reverend? I'm going to find Billy. You're not the law, Ray. You need to let the law handle this. I represent a higher law. God's law. Ray, just listen to me. And I heard a great voice out of the temple saying to the seven angels, Go and pour out the seven bowls of the fury of God upon the earth. You've gone berserk, Ray. You're not going nowhere. Give me those hog legs. That's right. Lock him up, Tim. Man's a menace. Enough! I'll lock all of you up if you don't shut your gaps. Give me your weapons, McCall. Don't. No! Oh my God! Oh, they shut down. down. The dogs and the sorcerers and the fornicators and the murderers and the idolaters and every one of them that loveth and maketh a lie. I knew this day would come, Padre. I knew that one day you'd show this town your true colors. You think you're better than me? We're two sides of the same coin, Ray. I'm glad you're finally here, because today is the last time you get in my way. And when they have finished their testimony, the beast that cometh up out of the abyss shall make war with them and overcome them. And there was given to the beast a mouth, speaking great things and blasphemies.
you're no man of God. I know what you are. I know who and you are. And there was given to the beast a mouth, saying great lies and blasphemies. Self righteous son of a whore. You think heaven wants anything to do with you? You're going to hell, and I'm gonna send you there. Babylon the Great has fallen, for all nations have drunk of the wine of the wrath of her fornication. Today is the holy seventh day. You didn't want to come to the Lord, so he sent down upon you the fire and a heavenly sword. Take heed of what I say, for if you won't listen, it shall be more tolerable for the land of Sodom and Gomorrah in the Day of Judgment than for this town. The Lord has made me his right hand, his judge, his jury, and his executioner. So, Billy, beware, boy, for I bring the wrath of God. The storm is coming. I can hear the thunder. Dark days for humankind are drawing near. For the great day of his wrath has come, and who shall be able to stand? I am your sword now, O Lord, and your will will be done. Hmm. I've been chasing that boy for days now. Took me some time to find his trail because he didn't run for the border as I was sure he would. Instead, he headed west. He's probably sitting out the storm in the Black River Mine. <laughs> Years ago, I did the same. I know every inch of those tunnels, and if he is down there, I will find him. by himself that's just not possible for all they that take the sword shall perish by the sword they call me Ned the plague because I bring death wherever I go what I want to know is who the hell are you I am the right hand of God I don't care whose hand you are Bill it you son of a bitch No. Frazier. 
Hey, can you hear me? Are you absolved and kindred soul? Soul of a murderer? The Lord can hear you. Speak your mind, son. I... The train will drop. And the bridge. And they'll blow up the track. Hurry. Valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Let all those who carry the mark of the beast cower in terror, for I will come for them as I follow the murderer's trail. Are you there, Billy Candle? Are you there, you son of the devil? I'm coming for you, and I bring hell unto thee. Gunshots. I must hurry. No! Help! What happened to those outlaws? They got what they deserved. The bastards took out the tracks on the bridge. It's a hard turn, so we always slow down there. Did you see anyone on the roof before the attack? On the roof? Yeah. I saw someone, all right. The soldiers went up after him and started shooting. Then we drove into the... What happened to him? The fellow on the roof? He ran away. I think he was wounded. Looked like he was heading south. There's farms not two miles from here. Thank you. May God be with you. You're leaving us? What if they come back? We've got the payroll for the whole damn railroad in here. Stay. You'll get a reward. Gold. Gold? For the love of money is the root of all evil. And some whose hearts were fixed on it have been turned away from the faith and been wounded with unnumbered sorrows. The sinner I'm after has already slaughtered one farm family. Now I need to bring him to justice. They'll be asking about you. What do you want me to say? Tell them that I'm... a missionary. Hey, preacher! You hear me? Preacher! You hadn't finished your work yet! Listen, there's a lot of money here. Let's split it up, all right? You killed a hell of a lot of people today. You ain't that much of a saint, are you? You turning me down? Or maybe you just want it all for yourself. Over my dead body, you hear? We'll settle this together, here and now. See the angels of death, they're gazing down upon me. They must be guiding me because I found the boy's trail swiftly. He's heading towards inhabited areas, he must be in despair. He has to know the end is near. By his tracks I can see he's limping, hurt, wounded and armed. Dangerous indeed. I must make haste. No time to rest. 
and fire came down out of heaven and devoured them. And the smoke... Hold on there. Who the hell are you? I'm the Lord's wrath, and in my hand I carry his sword. I'm looking for a young boy named Billy. Billy Candle? Are you looking for... Ty, I'm Tom Manson. This here is Ty Stewart, and these are the McClyde brothers. We're Texas Rangers, and we got a warrant out for the boy's arrest. We believe he's there on that ranch, working with a gang of rustlers led by a man named Ferguson. We're right about to bring some hell down on him. I hear Ferguson has a girl. Young and pretty and, uh... Shut it, McClyde. Padre, if you know how to use them hog legs, we can use any help we can get. Let's move! I heard tell of a man who wore armor like yours. They said that seeing him was like looking into death's very eyes. Well, he wasn't a man of God, though. Yeah, quite the opposite. So by now, he's he's probably pushing up daisies. And fire God, came down God, out of heaven God, and devoured God, them. God, 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 God. And there was given to the beast a mouth, speaking great things and blasphemy. And fire came down out of heaven and devoured them. Don't move! Drop your weapons! Where is he? I'll take care of him, Padre. Mind the boy. Let's... Time to meet your maker, boy. What are they doing? Where's the boy? The river took him. What's all this then? Search the river banks. We had an accident inside. That's not in for everyone that doth eat. Ray. We thought you were dead. What's going on here? Might as well tell him. Oh, we're not rangers, Reverend. But we're looking for the boy just like you. So why did you lie to me? Well, because it suited our purpose. But now we don't need you no more. What is happening here? They took my daughter. God! They said you were a rustler. A rustler? I'm a ranger. This is my home. Please, don't let them hurt her. They're headed for the river. You're gonna need a horse to get there in time. Don't let them get away. What have I done, Lord? Oh, God, what did I do? Righteous men are dead because of my blindness and arrogance. I killed Billy in your name, too. Was I wrong, Lord? Was he telling me the truth? Was he innocent as well? I'll save you, child. I'll make amends, Lord, whatever it takes. I promise you. Darkness is all around me. The light that has led me has deserted me. Did it ever exist? I'm on the kidnapper's trail. There's nothing else left. They're traveling down the river by raft, 
and they seldom break to camp. But in a few miles, the river flows into a canyon and changes into white water. There's a smuggler's trail there leading all the way to Mexico. They have to make landfall, and when they do, I will be there. It's my only chance to save that girl. the girl. I know who you are. I recognized you the moment I saw you. Only one man alive has the huevos to wear armor like that. Who do you think you are? A knight in shining armor, slaying dragons and saving fair damsels? Your day is done, old man. Your time has come. You've had a good run, but now it's my turn. Draw your weapon. Where have they taken that girl? Today, you'll stand in front of the Almighty, facing your judgment. So, you... Better talk while you still can, you low-life son of a bitch. Where have they taken that girl? War... Juarez! Juarez? Do you know who killed Billy's parents? Do you know who killed my brother? War is... Speak! You hear me? Tell me! War is... Hmm? So, all the events have come full circle. Is that what you wanted, Lord? Very well. To war is... Ray? It's all right, boy. I misjudged you, and for that I am truly sorry. The Lord is clearly on your side. Otherwise, you wouldn't still be alive. They got Molly. Yeah, because of me. But I'm gonna remedy that right now. You go hide yourself. I wanna help. No. Oh, no, no. This is my business now. I have to make amends and seek forgiveness for my arrogance. You get yourself to safety. God has told me to rescue this girl and punish those who took her. And when they have finished their testimony, the beast that cometh up out of the abyss shall make war with them and overcome them and kill them.
you've won? No, preacher, I've still got the girl. If Jew or that boy doesn't bring me the gold, that girl will die a slow and terrible death. We will take her and torture her and burn her alive. You hear me, Padre? The gold for the girl. You've got till noon. Thomas and I had a younger brother, William. Ah, he was the best of us, a man of faith. We were running cattle over the border from El Paso and would spend time in a little cantina in San Lorenzo. That's where I first laid eyes on Marissa. Oh, I knew she belonged to Ores, but I wanted her for mine. Marissa had other ideas, though. She was in love with Thomas. They ran off together, and I tracked them to these very caverns. Brother William begged me to walk away, but... Oh, I was crazy with greed. I wanted Marissa. I wanted the gold. Oh, now, William got between me and Thomas and reached into his coat. I thought he was going for a gun, so I shot him, my little brother. And as he fell, I saw what he was reaching for, a Bible. In that instant, I renounced evil and embraced the word of God. Oh, we left the gold. We knew it was cursed, and I dedicated my life to serving the Lord. I tried to make amends, but my sins were too great. Anger, hate, pride, arrogance. Oh, Lord, I humbly accept that the time has come for me to offer recompense for my transgressions. I'm not bringing peace, but the wrath of the Lord!
Thank you, Lord. Where's Juarez? He's dead. No time. It's not safe here. Follow me. Molly. Move it! Where's your god now, Padre? <laughs> You've made a mistake, Billy. A big mistake. I'm wearing armor as well. So throw out your gun and the bow. Do it! Well, gracias. Yeah, Billy. Your mother serviced Manson, Ty, and both McLeods before she died. I told them to treat her like a whore. Because that's what she was. And once I'm through killing you, this little puta will pleasure me too. Adios, mijo. failed you. All my life I have committed the sin of pride. Everything that has happened here is my fault. Lord, I have no right to ask you this, but please, please don't allow them to die because of me. If I only had a chance, the shadow of death. I will fear no evil. Back at the ranch, Molly asked me why I was running if I was innocent. Truth is, I've been running all my life. Running from everybody and everything. Calm Water said I couldn't run forever and he was right. Truth is, I'm tired of being afraid. I'm done fed up with it. Fed up with how I've been treated all my life. Like a nothing, like a nobody. And you know what? I got no one to blame for that but myself. Because I believed them. Thought they were right about me. But they weren't right. I'm not nobody. I'm Billy Candle, and I'm done running. If you don't like that, you can go to hell. <laughs> 